Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Facebook Messenger and more specifically, we're gonna show the steps that you need to take in order to send money through your Facebook Messenger to family and friends. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, if you're not familiar with Facebook Messenger, it's definitely one of the more popular messaging apps out there. It is different than the Facebook app slightly because it's a separate app. Basically what it is, is you can message back and forth, send pictures back and forth between family and friends. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up the app. It's this white and blue one. It has like a little thunderbolt right in the middle. If you don't have this app already, be sure to check my video description. I'll try to leave a referral link there, but I'm gonna go ahead and open up the Facebook Messenger app now. All right, so I went ahead and opened up the Facebook Messenger app and this is the home screen that's gonna show all of your recent chats from other friends or users that you've interacted with. But if you wanna go ahead and send money through Facebook, in order to set that up, you want to go ahead and choose a person you're going to send money to. So you can do that one of two different ways. You can click into one of the chats that you already have existing, which is what I'm going to do. Or you can go through here through the friend section. Let's go ahead and go through the chat function now. So for this person right here, I'm going to go ahead and send them a, some money through Facebook Messenger. So I'm going to go ahead and open up their chat now. All right, so I went ahead and opened up this chat and this is the chat screen. It may look familiar to you. So up here is going to have the name of the person that you have messaged back and forth with. Here you can make a phone call to that person person or a video call. But if you want to go ahead and send this person money, what you want to do is go ahead and look down here once you go into the messaging screen. So here's where you'd normally type back a reply or type to that person. But here on the left, you're going to have a couple of different options to add a picture or take a picture or send a voice message. But what you want to do is click on these four little dots right here and that's going to open up another menu. So I'm going to go ahead and click there now. All right, I went ahead and click there and then this menu right here, you can go ahead and play games with that person, send them your location. But it's pretty easy. You just want to click on payments, which is this green and white button right there. I'm going to click there now. All right, I went ahead and click there and then this button will pop up and it says you can send money in Facebook Messenger using a debit card or PayPal account to split meals, pay rent and more. And it also says it's available to anyone on Facebook in the US. So this is going to be something similar to either Venmo or Cash App, popular for splitting bills and things like that. I'm going to click this blue button down here called OK. I'm going to click there now. All right, next the screen pops up and it looks like it's already auto populated with my PayPal account, which is kind of interesting. I'm not sure exactly how Facebook Messenger has my PayPal account already. Either which way it is listed right there. Here you wanna go ahead and type the amount of money that you would like to send that person. So I'm gonna go ahead and send them a dollar. So I type that in a dollar. You can also type a note here. If you type right there, I'll just say test or I'll say happy holidays. All right, so I went ahead and typed that in. And actually I don't wanna use my PayPal account. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and change that payment option by clicking this blue button right here called change. I'm gonna click there now. All right, next this drop down menu happens. So it has my PayPal account right there. And again, I'm not sure where they pulled that information from, but it does have my current PayPal. Next right here, you can click add a debit card or add a different PayPal. I'm gonna go ahead and add a debit card. So I'm gonna click there now. All right, next Facebook Messenger is asking for the 16 digit debit card number I'm going to use along with the expiration date, security code, and billing zip code. And they are letting me know that debit cards are the only cards you can use. You cannot use a credit card for this sending money through Facebook Messenger. Just kind of keep in mind of that. So I'm gonna go ahead and enter all that information in off screen now. Okay, so I went ahead and entered in all of my debit card information in. Next, I'm gonna click this blue button up here on the top right called save. I'm gonna click there now. All right, next the screen pops up again and it looks like my visa is now listed instead of my PayPal. Again, if you want to change that, click that blue button right there. So verify you're sending it to the correct person up here and you can either click request for them to send you money or pay. I'm gonna go ahead and pay that person. So I'm gonna click there now. Next, this green button pops up asking me to confirm that I would like this, send this $1 payment to this person up here. I'm gonna click there now. All right, next the chat screen pops up again and then this is what it says. It says that I have sent $1 to that person for and then it says the note that I left, which is happy holidays. And then as you can see, this person has not seen the payment yet because their picture has not dropped down into this portion of the chat. So until they accept it, it says it is pending. Also, I received an email confirmation from Facebook. Let me switch over to that. All right, so here's the email confirmation that I received. It's letting me know when this payment was sent, who it was sent to, and how much it was for. And it includes some sort of payment ID just to, for a reference back if you need to contact Facebook about it. They're also letting me know that there were zero fees to send that money through Facebook Facebook Messenger, which is nice. So let me click back over to Facebook Messenger. All right, so here I am again. And then one nice thing or kind of interesting thing is when you send somebody money, when they open up the chat, the dollar sign comes dropping down from the top. Let me go ahead and switch back and I'll show you. So here's the dollar sign right here. As you can see, it just drops down through the screen, which is kind of funny. 
You can also click on view payment right here, this blue line underneath the payment. Let me click there now. All right, here on this screen, it says that the $1 payment is still pending until they accept the payment. And they're letting me know that that person has eight days to accept the payment before it expires. If it expires, then it just goes right back to you. Same thing here, it just shows the different information for that particular transaction. So there you have it. That is how you send money through Facebook Messenger. If you were able to send money through Facebook Messenger a quicker way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you were able to do it. But as far as I know, that's the easiest way to send money through Facebook Messenger. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up and I hope to see you on the next one. Thanks again for watching.